All right, so this might be a little bit hard to capture on camera, but I was very excited about my new uh, BQ uh, Nebula extruder. Uh, but I, unfortunately, I think I got the uh, built on Friday edition uh, before a long weekend. Um, so inside there's a filament sensor behind this piece here. And when I was first setting it up, nothing worked. And when I opened it up, I found that the plunger that sets the filament sensor was just, it had fallen out. So I was like, oh great, I can fix that, put the plunger in, double check the orientation, um, which isn't well documented. But it was reasonably obvious, one, one part is rounded, one part is flat. Uh, so I got it back in there. And so here's why I was, I was having issues with my, uh, with this switch. I was like, oh, I might have a wiring issue, whatever. Um, but right now you can see the sensor is not tripped. Uh, I'm currently actually running the orbiter uh, config, uh, the orbiter smart config. So if I screw down this screw, tighten up this screw that holds the stepper motor in place and the whole main body together and try not to knock it off of here. So that one is tight and this one is loose. So as soon as I tighten that screw, so I'll loosen it a bit. And they're not even, like those screws are not tight at this point. Like they're not wiggling, but they're, sorry, get a second hand there. Okay, so now you can see the filament sensor isn't tripped. I don't have filament in there, but as soon as I tighten this down a little bit, there. Sorry, it took a minute. So that's just tightening the uh, the screw. So now the, the stepper motor again. I can still tighten this more. Like I got another half turn out of each of those. So if I loosen it up a bit, so now it's loose. Piece of filament in, out, in, out. So the filament's working. Oh, no, there we go. Okay. But again, that motor is loose now, which isn't good. So I tighten it just a little bit more. There's just the two screws that hold everything together. And there, as soon as it's tight, it's loose and triggers again. Um, so yeah, I'll contact support. Um, but so far, not a, not a great start for my, my new little extruder. Anyway, thanks for watching.